Hello guys, Swift Strings here. Welcome to today's lesson. I'm so excited. Um, I want to thank you especially for your support. Um, <laughs> it's been a huge run, um, a massive support. Thank you guys for sharing my content, for liking, for subscribing. Man, it's over 2k um, subscribers and um, you guys have been so amazing. And for this reason, I have decided to like... Um, play some high life guitar um, as you all know I'm from Nigeria and um, we love high life music I'm sure you do love high life music so the song we are going to be doing today is titled Anu Relo Soro and I love the song so much um, the meaning in English it means it is your mercy that is speaking so God's mercy is speaking over my life and I believe, I pray God's mercy will speak over your lives as well. Um, so let's get started without wasting much of our time. There is a whole lot to learn and um, just like I said, High Life is a versatile um, music genre and um, really you're not doing much but if you know the... Um, <laughs> Um, the modules of Prandi of the genre, then you'll be fine. You don't need to know a, a whole lot of skills, just your major skill and um, your intervals, the double stops, and a few techniques, and you're good to go. So, I will try to um, incorporate some of this stuff I have mentioned. So, I'm playing the key of F. So the progression, it's a common one in high life. I'm playing one in the key of F, which is going to be my F major chord. Then the next chord is my D minor, which is my um, sixth in the key of F. Then the next chord is my G minor, which is my second degree in the key of F. And the last chord is my C major, or can you see C, which is my fifth, my five chord in the key of F. So I have one, two, six, two, two. Sometimes you can interchange the two, you can substitute with your four. Then lastly, then your five. So I have. <laughs> so um, let's delve into um, the rhythms first. The rhythms, of course, we'll go into the solo. But let me just because as a lead guitarist, um, you must know a lot of rhythms. Your rhythm is that part that makes you tingle. Your your body you, you shake to the groove. You understand? So that rhythmic part you want to as a lead guitarist, you want to make it solid and. First, you must know your chords. Then, from your chords, you can now begin to um, vary your rhythm, um, and it must also compensate. It must, um, it must match to the beat. It must not contradict. It must enhance. You understand? So now we know the chord. So most times, you don't play these big chords. You don't play the roots notes. I'm just playing. I play this recorded mini chord grips. Because the bassist is doing a whole lot. If you're in a full band where you have the bassist, you have the um, saxophonist, you have a whole lot of instrumentalists, then you play less. The more uh, the band, the bigger the band, the less you play. And the less the number of instrumentalists, you, the, the more you play, you understand? So you must be versatile. Um, so I'm going to be assuming um, you're the lead guitarist. So now, and another thing I want to mention before we um, go far is we we must uh, know a whole lot of inversions. Like this is my F. I can also I must know the other places on the neck. This is F. This is F. This is F. This is F. 
is F. You must know the whole spots. You can find your chords. So it's going to be easy for you. For instance, I can find myself here. Like I said, you don't need to play the, the whole big chord. You understand? So I can. The first rhythm. At the end of um, the lesson, I will provide, or just check in the description box, I will provide you with the backing track so you can practice with the backing track. So, um, it's very easy, the rhythm, I'm playing, I'm playing arpeggios, arpeggios is just broken chords. So I'm playing, I'm playing from my string two, I'm going to zoom in. So it's not going to be very lengthy. So there is a whole lot to do. So let me play with the loop. Now with the loop. So that'll be all for today. I'll see you in the next class. I played a couple of readings. I'm also going to drop a link to the first um, video I did where I played um, the a couple of readings so you can follow. We'll be breaking those readings down in the subsequent videos. Thank you once again for joining. Um, share this video, like and subscribe. Um, <laughs> stay tuned for more awesome contents. I love you all. Bye. Thank you.